What up, YouTube? It's your boy Savio back again with another reaction video. I just finished doing the reaction to the Singularity video, and I, I wanted to do the Explained video just so I can get more understanding on the song. So here we are. I'm going to be reacting to the Explained video by Bookish Theories because the last Explained video I did DK DK TV, which was what you guys told me to do before that. But you're like, no, don't do that one. Do Bookish Theories. So now we're doing Bookish Theories. If you guys freaking tell me to go to somebody else for these Explained videos bro i'm gonna fight y'all like we we gonna fight i'm gonna come to every one of y'all houses every one of y'all countries and y'all gonna have to individually put y'all dukes up we fight anyway i actually just saw this behind me you guys have told me that that the symbol on my door looks like the bts logo which is funny because i painted that myself and it's supposed to be an hourglass um but cool if it, if it gets you more in the vibe then i'm glad you guys like it i like it and don't plan on repainting it anytime soon so if you don't like it then it sucks to suck we're going <laughs> anyway without further ado we're going to get into this explained video by bookish theories i don't know how deep this song is going to be i don't know if it connects to the whole you know MCU with the the BTS you what you know you know what I'm saying yeah I oh oh I just realized I didn't make an anime reference in the entire last video I'm weebdom is so disappointed in me I'm sorry I'll try to fit one in there at some point during this video but that song took me by storm I was not ready at all no <laughs> no she she wasn't ready she wasn't ready that's a great clip oh man i gotta figure out ways to put that clip in there more anyway let's get into this video guys and i'll see you on the other side peace hello and welcome back to bookish theories in today's video, I would like to talk about V's intro Singularity, focusing on a little breakdown and analysis of both the lyrics and the music video. Singularity is a neo-soul song that deals with the themes of identity, loneliness, and self-reflection. In the V Live Aram held after the release of Love Yourself Tear, he stated that the song was inspired by a book by Ray Kurzweil called The Singularity is Near, When Humans Transcend Biology. In the book, Kurzweil, who is an inventor and futurist, talks about the role of artificial intelligence in humanity's future. He discusses the ways in which AI, nanotechnology and robotics will change mankind to the point of no return, and predicts a future when machine intelligence and humanity will merge together as a next step of evolution. Now, the book is more than 600 pages long and extremely difficult to understand. But what does AI and human evolution have to do with V and his intro? Well, yeah. in order to answer this question, the first thing that we need to do is to understand what singularity actually is. If we take a look at the dictionary and consider the themes of the song and what Aram said in the V Live, two definitions in particular are worth looking into. On a general level, singularity refers to the state of being singular, that is being unique, different, but also strange in a way. Being singular means to be exceptional, but also a single individual, alone if you will, because you are not like everybody else. As we'll see in a second, this condition is very fitting with the lyrics, but let's take a look at the second meaning first. If we take into account the book mentioned by Aram, then singularity also refers to the hypothetical moment in time when technology becomes so advanced that humanity undergoes a drastic and irreversible change. If we put so I'm trying to figure out if this is like some we're going into the matrix or like Digimon, like your your brain Digimon. There we go, anime reference. Get them where your your consciousness is on a digital plane, where you're having a a Ready Player One but permanent type experience, where you're you you no longer have a body. You're Brainiac basically from comics if, if you know dc villain okay whatever where you're you're no longer really experiencing life physically but you're mentally still experiencing life but through the form of a simulation does this have to do with simulation theory is that where this is going because elon musk can can explain this way better than i can 
the two definitions together, then the singularity V is singing about is the point of no return when somebody becomes aware of being singular, an individual that is unique but also lonely because of that. This is a moment of change they cannot go back from, a moment of self-awareness that triggers self-reflection. Now, bear in mind, Singularity is the first song that was released after Love Yourself, Her. So right off the bat, the change implied in the title is pretty obvious. From the optimistic and romantic vibe of Her, we move to a darker concept that deals with the toxic and negative aspects of love and the ending of a relationship. So Singularity should be regarded as a bridge of sorts between the two themes. In so this is a breakup? So at first I was getting simulation theory vibes and then I was getting oh this is I realized that I am a genius I'm I am built differently than everyone else I I am as Kanye would say a god and therefore I'm different and lonely and now I'm feeling like this is a breakup so I'm why why am I always confused even on the explanation videos these boys still be confusing me. I don't get it. In the song, change is approached as something that creeps in almost unexpectedly. It's a dream, an illusion, but this is... Yo, that jacket is so cold, man. That thing giving me like Jon Snow meets Overhaul from My Hero Academia. Go watch My Hero Academia, bro. Also, I'm coming with the nerdy references this video. I'm so proud of myself. Anyway, that jacket fight. Illusion turns into a painful reality that triggers this change of perception in the first place. The moment of self-reflection V is singing about is caused by the same love described in song. I think this is the, the clip of the performance that I saw. Self-reflection V is singing about is caused by the same love described in songs like Serendipity and DNA. Back then, love was a positive feeling, something real and heartfelt. But now it's over, and Singularity introduces us to the idea that that love was a fake love all along. Let's take a look at the lyrics to see what I mean. This is off the same album as Fake Love, because if so, eh, 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 you're clever, I see what you did there. If not, then, um, awkward. At the beginning, the song opens with V awakening from sleep. Right off the bat, this is very telling because it implies that what came before was a dream. The love, the comfort, the hope even are all things of the past. But now he is awake and reality is waiting for him. In the music video, the world that surrounds him is very minimal. The colors here are mainly neutral, which is something that conveys the desolating feeling that follows his awakening. But every once in a while, bright colors engulf him, which implies that traces of the dream still linger in reality. The main colors that we see here are red, blue and purple. Now the red first appears when B sings about the pain he feels in his throat. In the song, he doesn't have a voice, and this is important because as a singer, his voice is what defines him, a symbol of his identity, if you will. Later on, it is revealed that the sound that awakes him is the cracking of a frozen lake, a lake that he dumped himself into and through which he buried his voice for you. Now, if we take into account how personal BTS music usually is, singularity may be seen as a statement of the members' feelings regarding their fame and popularity. The lyrics here... Okay, that's that's what I said earlier. I was talking about the, the whole Kanye West point where you, you realize that you aren't normal, these boys are not normal, they are superstars and are treated as such, and it's a very isolating, almost dehumanizing feeling for people to treat you in the way that that people of this caliber get treated but i don't know how that connects to to the matrix or or the heartbreak i'm the confused that could be read as them sacrificing their real voice and their identity in order to please us. And this idea would also be confirmed by the fact that at the end of the video, we see V being loved and surrounded by the purple, but still wearing a mask that cries a black tear. As the lyrics say, he lost himself, but gained us. And at the end, wow. he questions if all he did actually meant anything. He wonders what... Wow. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, that I've lost myself, but I gained you part is, whoa, 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 jeez, that's, 
that's heavy. That's some some deep stuff because it it be like that sometimes. I personally have a saying that I'd rather be hated for who I am than loved for who I'm not, which is why on my channel you will consistently see me saying that I'm gonna be honest regardless of how people feel about it. But wow, that is that's that is what people are saying when they're talking about selling their soul. They they sold what makes them them who they are to be able to acquire money or fame or adoration from fans or a, a record deal, a, a job in a particular field. It's, yeah, wow, that's, wow. What was he supposed to do back then instead of throwing himself away? This view is very plausible, but at the same time, it kind of ignores the real meaning of the word singularity. Because in the book mentioned by Aram, singularity refers to a universal change. This means that while the song may be referring to something personal, it's more likely that the focus is on the universality of the feelings B is singing about. Even if all of us are unique individuals, we all suffer the same. And most importantly, we all sacrifice ourselves when we are in love. We put on masks, we lose ourselves and pretend to be someone that we are not because we think that this is the only way somebody will love us. That's sad, but so true. That, yeah, a lot of times people hide parts of themselves because they're afraid that those dark parts of themselves, their shadows, if you will, eh, 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 I know that's a later album, I don't care, shut up. They hide those parts of themselves because of fear that showing their true selves will cause rejection from again, either the masses in their case, or a particular person, a spouse, parent, whatever. And that is a universal feeling because that can be attached to anything. Me, just me, I felt that same feeling in several different instances with different people who weren't all in the same role in my life. So I, wow. Not what I thought this song was about at all. I thought this was going to be like some, I'm outside your window at 11.45 p.m. and it's raining and I'm crying. Baby, please take me back. I did not think this was going to be about universal singularity, but I mean... BTS. So, so what do I expect? This is of course a very dark way of looking at love, but this is literally the old point of love yourself tier. So singularity introduces us to that concept. The entire album revolves around the idea of becoming aware that love cannot save you unless you love yourself first. And singularity portrays the moment of change in which this realization actually takes place. In the song, V says that he cannot go back to sleep. And this is so because this change is irreversible. Once we realize that somebody's love is not the answer, that love becomes a fake love. Because according to BTS, the only way you can truly love and be loved is to love yourself first. Accepting this, however, is not easy. And the video shows this when V dances with the coat rack. Here, he just woke up, so he's still longing for that dream of love. But he's alone, and the rest of the video shows him coming to terms with his loneliness. The red, the blue and the purple in this scenario convey the feelings that follow his awakening. We see the red of love and passion turning into the purple that links the love to the sadness symbolized by the blue. And all these feelings are experienced in solitude. There's only him and his masks and the song offers no resolution to his phantom pain. This is so because singularity marks the change but not the solution. The solution will be found in answer, but singularity shows you how the process of loving yourself actually begins. By realizing that you are exceptional, but also alone. And because of that, you have to be the first one that loves you. The frozen lake in this scenario symbolizes the depths of- Okay, I know, she's in the middle of a sentence. I'm gonna go back. Your boy trying to follow. The video almost over, so we, we gonna be okay. So, overarching theme is you are unique. Because you are unique, you are exceptional. Because you are exceptional, you are different. Because you are different, you are lonely. Because you are lonely, you have to love yourself because no one else can love you like you can love you and no one else can love you until you love you. 
then I think I'm missing something. Or maybe that's the end. I don't know. Still kind of confused, to be honest. <laughs> of human identity. In the song, the lake cracks because this symbolizes that you have to be the first one that loves you. The frozen lake in this scenario symbolizes the depths of human identity. In the song, the lake cracks because this is the beginning of the journey. It's cold, painful, and you can drown if you are not careful. But there's hope, because spring, even if it's not here yet, will come and melt the ice. So, that's it from me today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, please think about liking and subscribing. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye! Okay, to be honest, I'm not sure if that video answered more questions or gave me more questions. I did pick up on the flowers thing, and I'm assuming that relates to the spring, and then like him loving himself part, but then like, as she said, he put the mask on at the end, so like that's not really love. Also, purple is a combination of the colors red and blue, and it went red, blue, purple, and, and then went red, purple, blue, so I think she said the, it ended on the sadness. I don't know. I didn't even know that black and white where he was laying down, that that was like an ice lake, like Elsa. I, dog, I don't know. I really don't. It's a great song. Maybe I need to watch that thing three, four more times, but hopefully I, I got it. Sometimes when I be confused like this, thinking I'm off on a tangent, and you guys be like, wait, no, you were actually close. You kind of got the general idea of what was going on. Hopefully this is one of those times because like the whole singularity piece is quite confusing and the connecting the book on technology and mankind eventually coming together and how that ends up relating to a breakup is kind of confusing to me because one is coming together and the other is I mean, part, right? The part about the, the fame, where you, you come to a realization that you're being treated different and that makes you feel lonely, I get that. And I've heard that countless times from celebrities. I think it's a little bit better for celebrities who can interact with their fans in a more intimate way. But yeah, I, I'm not sure how all these things connect, to be honest, but sounds great. So, you know, I, I really don't care if he's saying gobbledygook, gobbledygook, because your boy gonna bump it regardless, but um, they out the frozen lakes and hope for spring. I'm a spring baby. I don't like winter, so I, you don't have to tell me twice. I'm gonna be good. But in the meantime, hopefully you found some type of meaning out of out of this video, cause your boy confused. But um, thanks for being here with me. I appreciated it. Today has been fun. I'm glad to finally get some videos up again. And I will be seeing you guys very soon, hopefully, if my camera keep, continues to work. But if it doesn't, then know that I'm with you in spirit. Okay? Bye, guys. I'll see you next time. Peace.